sounds. What's up, you guys? Snipes here with TKO Gaming. We are here about to talk about some exciting new things coming into Destiny, leading into Destiny 2. My friends, wow, this game, just, just reflecting back at everything that we've been through and everything that such a great company like Bungie has presented, man, I can't, I can't thank them enough. Um, it's been a great, great ride with every single one of you guys and no, this obviously isn't a goodbye even though I just realized it kind of sounds like one. But I'm here to talk to you guys about some cool things coming up October 13th with that Eververse trading company coming into Destiny, um, with the Iron Banner coming back, with Trials of Osiris coming back, um, what that means for TKO Gaming, what that could possibly mean for Destiny, my opinion, and whatever else. So let's get into it guys. First off, thank you guys so much for all the support and just taking the time out to watch my videos. I know I'm a nobody, but hey, uh, honestly, uh, with you guys, uh, I feel like a somebody, so thank you so much. All right, let's get into it. So, as you guys know, October 13th, Bungie has announced that they will be bringing Tess Everest back with that Eververse trading company stuff, which is pretty much 18 uh, emotes, uh, possibly like dancing emotes is what they were saying. So I'm really hoping that we can do the whip and nene and possibly like twerking. I don't know. That'd be pretty cool. My hunter's been meaning to twerk for a while. But uh, let me know what you guys are excited about. What possible dances you guys would be really... I want the Macarena. I mean, honestly, that'd be pretty cool. That was like my childhood dance. Or the electric slide. Yeah, that's right. Anyways, so uh, pretty much uh, we have microtransactions in Destiny coming up, guys. We, we will be able to buy in-game currency called silver which we will be able to use for um, those emotes that I mentioned uh, and it's kind of interesting uh, that you know Bungie is introducing this first when I heard about this I was like oh no uh, Activision is kicking in this is a uh, Something that, uh, you know, uh, we've seen in Call of Duty with the gun camos and, and stuff. And I'm like, oh man, it's coming to Destiny. And and I remember in Halo 3, Bungie used to, you had in-game transaction where you can actually buy film space. You used to have, um, like, file film share space uh, back when there wasn't an Xbox One. And you could, you know, share your game clips with people and just, you know, it was, you, you could buy more slots. Uh, in game and I was like oh man is that really coming back in for destiny that kind of makes me feel some type of way and it's here or it's on its way and I was really upset when I first heard it but then I started thinking now as you guys know I'm a finance major I graduated from the University of Washington uh, Foster School of Business with my finance degree so I'm always around people that that you know think of businesses or you know are all about the money and um, you know, I always I always enjoyed um, listening to people as they talk about money and businesses and, and whatnot and how they justify things. Uh, and then I got to thinking on uh, from maybe like a company standpoint, why would Bungie do this? And I think they I think that uh, on October 5th, when uh, Deej posted that uh, the post on on Bungie in the community news uh, announcing that this is coming, I thought that was I thought that was great. I thought the way he wrote it, um, it established goodwill with the community. It let the community know that we care about you guys and, and we're not here to, you know, in a way, take all your money or anything like that. We're here to, to listen to you guys and go from there. And one thing I really liked is that they were like, they, they justified, they gave you a reason. It wasn't like, hey, we're doing microtransactions. You guys, you guys, if you guys want to buy these emotes, you can buy them. You know, we're just going to make more money off you guys. It was really, hey, these emotes, we're doing this. And they, they pretty much laid it out. Hey, we're doing this because we want to make sure that we have enough funding available for upcoming things in Destiny. New missions, new quests, new raids, you know, all the way leading up to Destiny 2, new DLCs. We don't want to charge you guys for those DLCs. We don't want... Uh, some people who, who can't afford the DLCs to be left out while other people are reaping all the benefits of all the new Destiny stuff and I thought that was great I, I think you know having a trade-off of something that's not going to affect the game at all and people being able to twerk and nay nay and all the, these extra things it's not going to affect our gameplay at all guys it's it's something that we don't really have to worry about it's not going to affect the raid loot it's not going to affect 
Crucible is not going to affect Trials of Osiris or Iron Banner. Yeah, you might get killed and you might get, you know, instead of teabagged, you might get twerked on. But still, that's for a trade off of having free um, quests and missions and all these extra things, like, that's completely understandable, especially from, a, from just a business standpoint. Like, you know, all this gaming content, even though we are paying for Xbox Live or, or PlayStation Live or, or whatever else it is. And, um, you know, we are we have been paying for the content and stuff. It's really something from just looking at it from Bungie's standpoint. It's not a bad idea, you know, and and I know how crazy people get for this game. It's it's something that that a lot of people won't mind doing. And, you know, for your next birthday present or or Christmas, you can ask for for twerk emotes and Nene emotes on Destiny. So it just gives everybody I think it's a great thing. It's going to make everyone happy. And, um, you know, you can't hate a company for wanting to make more money. You just can't. Like, they're giving us a product where many of us, I mean, if you're watching this video, you find value in Destiny, right? For me, it's an outlet to get away from life. You know, life has a lot of crap, a lot of BS in it. it for me, it's a way to just step away from the bullshit and, and have fun with my friends and and just own in a game that i love get better improve on my shortcomings make videos for you guys like i think that you know that's just my opinion that's my two cents i know a lot of people are going to be pissed and i really hope this doesn't grow into something crazy like i hope you can't purchase exotic engrams or legendary engrams with money and i really hope you can't do that in the future but hey for now i i think destiny's future is looking pretty solid um as you guys know uh, Iron Banner's coming back. That's going to be awesome with some cool, cool loot. And uh, Trials of Osiris is coming back. And if you guys know me or TKO Gaming, you already know that that you know Trials of Osiris is something that we very we pride ourselves in. You know, we've carried over a thousand guardians to the lighthouse collectively as a team, and we're gonna go for a thousand more, or even more than that. So please do stop by. Um, in the live stream if you want if you guys are at all interested in that or if you guys just want to watch and, and learn some new strategies that we come up with um we're always looking to get better at this game guys it's it's a it's a fantastic thing it's really something that we really enjoy and we it needs to stay that way you know if we wouldn't be here i wouldn't be here if i didn't enjoy this you know you guys wouldn't be here if you guys didn't enjoy this and so let's keep that in mind and and let's go into you know all the new things with that are coming in Destiny with an open mind and open heart and I can't wait uh, to see where this game takes um, all of us really so thank you guys once again for all the love and support I, I, I can't thank you guys enough and uh, yeah shoot me a friend request follow me on Xbox check out my clips check out the other YouTube videos if you haven't a thumbs up on any video or a share to your friends on any of my videos means a lot and it helps a lot so if you guys can do that, that would mean a lot. And I will definitely see you guys in the next video. Until then, guys, be safe. Peace out.